p.m. Revs. Revolutions. Do your balls rotate properly. <laughs> anyway, a few ways to say it and a few ways to measure it. But only one is correct. Check it out. RPM, or revolutions per minute, is a measure of how fast a ball is rotating around its PAP. What is the PAP? Well, it's... It's that. These methods are easy and quick and practical, but they don't tell the whole truth. You can't handle the truth! It's more, actually, more like an approximation that can vary a lot. But why, you might ask? Well, to answer that, let's briefly analyze the physics of a ball going down the lane. We release the ball, giving it some kinetic energy. It usually drops in oil and skids. And it also rotates, because we also gave it some spin, some angular kinetic energy. But since it is on oil and friction is minimal, the ball moves pretty much on a straight line. But then, gradually it encounters higher friction, so some of the linear kinetic energy is transformed to rotational energy. So this makes the ball decelerate, and at the same time, it spins faster. So conclusion from this. Your bowling ball is always going to have more revolutions uh, near the pins than near you when you release it. And if you play on a shorter pattern or with uh, less oil, you're going to see even more revs because the ball decelerates earlier. Also, if you play a part of the pattern that has that is more drier than uh, another part that has uh, a lot of oil, you're going to see again some differences. Or if you use more or less speed. So, all of these have, are related to friction, so even if you have a shiny ball versus a dull ball, again you're going to see some difference in the rotations that you calculate. So, let's do a test. I'm going to show you two bowling shots and we're going to use the, the easy method and count the revs. What is this method that enables us to remove all these variables and gives us the true number of uh, revolutions that the player imparts on the ball? Sure, if you're in a hurry or you want just a ballpark number of the revs that somebody has, you can use these uh, easy methods. But if you want to be precise, you gotta use this one. <laughs> 